Okay. Hello. Now that I unmuted. How's it going, guys? Hope you're having a good night. I'm having a good night. And tonight is our first night as a new Twitch affiliate. Their new Twitch's new program they have going on where up and coming streamers can basically get some of the perks of a Twitch partnership without a full Twitch partnership. So hence the cup that is right down over here that you guys can f donate some bits if you want or follows it fills up subs it fills up and I will have over on the far left of your screen a little ticker with any and all donations on it kind of my way to highlight anybody that helps out the channel I have you now. <laughs> with two rather unhappy babies in the house at the moment uh crazy foe thank you for the follow welcome to the channel eisenwolf welcome back crazy foe thanks again and thank you for the congratulations i uh i had no idea twitch had an affiliate program i knew they had the partnership but that's you got to be pretty well established on twitch in order to qualify for the partnership so I'm rather glad they started the affiliate program. So this lets me do a couple extra things. And as we grow, I'm able to offer a few more things to give back to you wonderful people who are following me. So Stormer, thanks for joining me on Twitch, man. I'm glad you could join it. I'm glad you followed me over from YouTube because yeah, just uh, just more opportunity here on, on Twitch for me right now with the Twitch affiliate program. So. Now, we are going to continue our campaign for tonnage, baby, tonnage. <laughs> you're being... You're being diaper bombed? Oh. <laughs> and wet diapers are being thrown around my house right now. All the joys of having a child and a little cousin. That child's cousin here as well. My sister's boy and my daughter are both here. Alright, first off, before we start this in earnest, I'd like to thank Quas Seabass, one of our moderators. He has made a kind of a basic bot for my Twitch channel that will grow over time as he programs more things in and as I program more things in. Well, I make him... I basically crack a whip and he adds more things to the bot. So it's, it's kind of a nice working relationship we have going on. Uh, I only make him kiss one of my feet at night, so I'm actually a pretty generous host. So, yeah. Yes, that is baby critical mass in the background. <laughs> uh, Crazy Foe says it's a learning computer. Uh, God, I hope Seabass hasn't programmed that thing to be, to learn. That would, that's rather scary. Alright, what the heck is our mission, anyways? Uh, we have, get this forward a little bit more, there we go. All right, Wolfpack returning after having successfully operated against NATO shipping. So they're going to try to sneak through the gap. Oh, and I have updated to the beta version of Cold Waters, which is 1.06 Bravo, which should fix some of the issues that this mod is having. For instance, last night I basically was not using the 8th torpedo tube because it was glitched, as with the 7th. But now it should be working again. <laughs> Eisenwolf says, well, this will settle the issues with YouTube, sort of. You mean the you, they're crazy over on YouTube issues? <laughs> Seabass is turning into hell. That's, that's rather, that's rather unnerving. <laughs> so yes, uh, Seabass, go ahead and as things go over on on Twitch, feel free and include everybody in what your bot can do. Basically, all the bot does is bust my balls. <laughs> so, you guys have fun with that. The bot is basically just as evil as the rest of you are. <laughs> Keeps track of all of my mistakes and my screw-ups. Oh, the multi-stream issue, yes. Is the beta considered stable? The beta is... Con is Stay as stable. It's basically hot code. So, 
Pearlstormer, thanks for the follow on Twitch, you're, even though you're subscribed on YouTube. And guys, I will continue to upload all my streams onto my YouTube channel, so those of you who can't make the live showings, I will definitely get them up the following day on my YouTube channel, so make sure everybody can still see it. Uh, Lake One rolled it out a few weeks ago, I believe. Yep, the uh, Twitch affiliate program. Sorry, I missed your chats, by the way. Hello, by the way. Hello to you. Welcome to the stream. All right. Enemy at sea replenishment takers and tenders. Possible capital ship in this group. <laughs> Trying to keep babies happy in the background. So don't mind the noise. It's just a uh, baby baby happiness going on in the background. Um, I really hope something pops up for that. Guys, was there an announcement from Digital Pope? Hmm. Let me double check and make sure that's working. Because that should have popped up on screen. Come on. That should have definitely popped up. Oh, that's why. There we go. My apologies. Digital Pope just subscribed with Twitch Prime. Thank you, Digital Pope, for being my first subscriber on Twitch. Um, hmm. I wonder if I can do that. Yes? Cheddar biscuits. Okay. My wife loves me, after all. She bought me some cheddar biscuits. Okay, let's try this. With each there we go. You make yourself more my servant. <laughs> That's what I was looking for. Thank you, Digital Pope. Welcome back to the stream. Um, so we're going to continue on course. We failed that mission, but we're now going to go try to find the tenders. <laughs> Can you screw up that? No, you can't screw up that. <laughs> that wasn't a sub screw up, Seabass. Where are they headed? I forgot to check that. To the Greenland Sea from Murmansk. Okay. Toaway, welcome back to the stream. Glad to see ya. Oh, these guys are all going to be chasing me now. That aircraft spotted me. Okay, this, I believe, is our target. You're the man, Pope, says Earl Stormer. Thank you. And Stormer also says, You're welcome, Utter Exodus. Need to get my other grilling friend over here. Damn, name escapes me. Red Rider is the one I believe you're talking about. Yeah, you and Red Rider are, uh... You guys need to let go of my balls every now and then, because they get kind of sore. <laughs> this little Pope says, Been waiting on one of you dorks to get a sub button. <laughs> well, thank you very much, Digital Pope. I appreciate it. And yes, I'm, uh, Jive opted not to do the Twitch affiliate program because he grew faster on YouTube, whereas I had been growing faster on Twitch. So it just kind of worked out for me and not really a good fit for him. But thank you very much. I'm glad I got, I'm glad I got the announcement working again for you. Red, we make you hungry. Red does the busting. Yeah, yeah, pretty much. Just, you're all evil. So, okay. This is supposedly what was fixed. I have tube 8 selected right now. Now if I hit R for reload. Oh my god, it works. It works. I can use all 8 tubes now on the Seawolf. Makes me exceedingly happy. We're going to reload a couple of harpoons in here. And by a couple, I mean three. We're going 10 knots at 150 feet. New sonar contact bearing 1, 2, 3. No layer. So no layer to hide under. That's kind of unfortunate. Our depth, 150. Our heading, 37. All right, so they're about 90 degrees to our right. All righty. <laughs> Eisenwolf, what does a uh, subscription mean? <laughs> I, I always get, I always get suspicious when either you or Seabass use quotes. <laughs> All right, sonar, give me all the good contacts. Zero, Con one sonar, and two. New contact bearing. There zero, we go. Nine, That's what I like five. to see. Designated Sierra three. That's what I like to see. This looks like a, it's a crivac. 
Not a Krivak. What the hell else is that? Oh, that's a Grisha. That's a Grisha, isn't it? Yep, Grisha Con, 3. Sonar, Sierra, 1. Is and Sierra 3. Escort. Con, oh, man, Sonar, I was Sierra, really hoping for a capital ship escort. in this group. And that's a Don. Con, Sonar, Sonar, be on the lookout Sierra, for submerged contact. Merchant. The Don is a submarine tender. So odds are there's a sub out there. Seabass <laughs> says, has it occurred to anyone else that submarines are just reverse blimps? Well, not really. All right, maybe. Maybe a little bit. Just a little bit. All right, Grisha, Don, and Grisha. There's got to be a submerged contact out there. LE is at 88. Not extremely noisy, but not extremely quiet either. All right, how? Dive. Make your depth five zero feet. Come to periscope depth. <laughs> With inverted aerial combat rules. <laughs> yeah, you guys are. You guys are right on on that. Passing one hundred feet. Passing one hundred feet. I gotta remember that I have the voice overs activated and I don't have to do as much as I've trained myself to do. Toway says aquariums are just submarines for fish. <laughs> uh, you guys got the jokes tonight. Approaching periscope depth. We're going to come to four or five feet. Get above any waves that are up there. All right. Up scope, up ESM. Alright, they're bearing like 113. There's one. That would be one of the Grishas. Let's get an accurate range. Grisha, this bearing mark. Oh, come on, laser rangefinder work. I don't know why I have such problem with the laser rangefinder all the time. Oh well. There's the Dawn. And there's the other Grisha. Alright. No other surface contacts. Doesn't look that way. So it's just these three and a probable submarine somewhere in the area. If I had to guess, it's probably a diesel electric. Red Rider, <laughs> welcome to the Twitch chat, Red Rider. I was kind of hoping you were going to give me a night's break, but, you know, that would be uncharacteristically nice of you. <laughs> All right, we're actually just going to be a jerk. And these harpoons on all three targets. Actually, just on the two Grishas. All right, fire point procedure. Master 1, Grisha 3. Bearing 126, range 8400 yards. Shoot 3. Five point procedure. Whoops. Go back to the missile. Five point procedure. Sierra 3, Master 3. Bearing 085, range 11,100 yards. Shoot Con. 7. Torpedo room. Firing 2 7. Missile on track. Flares. Con, sonar, yes! Off contact. One Last Grisha down. One. Grisha's Last only Sea Wiz is two. on the aft. Contact breaking up. So they have no Sea Wiz forward. This Grisha might have just screwed itself over. He's turning back into the missile. Not bad. He's trying really hard to dodge. Con, torpedo room, tube four ready. Oh, you gotta be kidding me! Okay, good on you, Grisha. Damn. All right. We're going to try one more harpoon on Master 3. Firepoint procedure. Master 3, Grisha. Tube 4 missile bearing 0, 8, 5, range 9, 300 yards. Shoot 4. Torpedo room. Fire. Torpedo room, reload all tubes. Uh... Outer standoff weapon, Exodus. <laughs> Red Rider says, but I'm just going to have this in the background for a while anyways. I have some prep work to do on some ice cream for Saturday's 12th, actually 13th, 
annual chili cook-off. Nice. Sounds like fun. Sonar lost Second harpoon three, hit the target. Last bearing, zero, Perfect. Eight, nine, and Lake nine, One nine, says nine. running a modded Los Angeles. Actually, I am running the 2004 campaign mod, and this is the Sea Wolf class. Con, torpedo yep, room, thanks, Sea Bass. Looked VLS. Nope, these are all canister launched. Eight tube Sea Wolf. Yep. Good call, guys. Good call. You guys are on top of it. All right, Don is turning. We're going to shoot at the Don with the torpedo. Helm, head two. Head two thirds. Yeah, oh head two thirds. We're going to try to bait any sub that's out there. And sink this Don at the same time. All right, steady on course. One, one, four. Check that one two zero. Con torpedo room two four ready. Lake one says I played the P eight in dangerous waters trying to murder my friend in the Sea Wolf. <laughs> Did you actually have any luck finding him? Because in real life a P three or a P eight would have a lot of difficulty finding a Sea Wolf if the Sea Wolf chose to be quiet. There we go one two zero. All right, we're going to put a torpedo on the Don here. Firepower procedure, Master 2 Don. Tube 5, bearing 117, range to enable 10,100 yards. Shoot Con, 5. Torpedo room, firing tube 5. <laughs> There's a rush for the lifeboats on the Don. Probably at this point, after seeing her two escorts just go... Lake 1 says, I got lucky with Matt on occasion. Follow up with active buoy on the spot, pretty effective. But you must have gotten really lucky with Matt, because Matt range is not very large. 500 on a bad day, possibly 1,000 on a good day. Why a torp? Because one harpoon probably won't kill a Don. Guns are a bit on the larger side. Up radar. I want to see where this guy's now. actually headed. And Red Rider says, while I'm at the counter, anyone else want some rum? <laughs> Looks like Red Rider's the bartender for tonight's stream, gents. Abuse him while you can. <laughs> Lake One says, well, I would be flying low enough to ram his conning tower if he... <laughs> so you were cheating, in other words. No, not cheating. Digital Pope says, now you just need to use some of that big fat Twitch money and upgrade from potato upload. Well, yeah. Yeah, I gotta get the big fat Twitch money first to up upgrade my internet speed. But that's one of the goals. It's one of the goals. I'd really like to be able to upgrade that. And guys, holler at me in chat if the stream starts chugging. Because I'm hoping... I'm hoping streaming directly to Twitch instead of restream and then to Twitch will help fix some of the quality issues that we've been having but I'm not entirely sure it will. Still no submerged contact. Torpedo enabled. And this should be a rather pretty picture. Don is actually pretty heavily armed, but only against uh, nearby surface ships and aircraft. It's actually a good view with the moon in the background. That's actually a good view with the whole explosion and everything. <laughs> Alrighty. 
quality today is a bit more consistent. So that's good. That's good to hear. And Eisenwolf, so far everything looks good. Lake One says, he did manage to pop stingers off on me once or twice. It went both ways in the end. Yeah. <laughs> the British have the best aircraft names after the Nimrod. If <laughs> the uh, US named an aircraft Nimrod. No, we're too PC here in the States now to name an aircraft Nimrod. And there wasn't a sub that Don may not have met up with the sub yet because the two groups will merge when it meets up with the ship it's trying to refuel so we got the tender yeah yeah safe seas <laughs> we need one called ramrod says crazy foe <laughs> Alright, let's reload tube 5. <laughs> Farva. <laughs> oh my god. Really? Super Troopers reference. And we just got uh, ambushed. Alright. We're going to sink these guys real fast. Because we're quiet. No surface duck, no lair. We'll hear them. Break ship. Break ship for ultra quiet. For ultra quiet. I'm going to get better at this not interrupting the voiceovers thing. Like I said, we're going to hear them. Oh, it's 111 decibel outside. Um, very noisy. Very, very noisy. Alright, so they're within 15,000 yards. It's kind of a cheap way of checking, but I'm going to do it just so I have a shot at finding them. Alright, dive all down on the planes, all down ballast. Make your depth 500 feet. Let's get away from the surface 100 noise. 200 feet. Passing 200 feet. Passing 300 feet. Passing 400 feet. <laughs> And the first Hans bit don't bit cheer from Caked, who happens to be my sister. Thank you, Caked. <laughs> and yes, that was R2D2. I'm a I'm a slight nerd. It's okay. <laughs> Standing by on the active sonar button, sir? Yeah, that might get me shot and killed. Well, at least I know the cup works. Thank you, Caked. Appreciate it. <laughs> and yes, Eisenwolf, I know the active sonar is going to happen. Passing 500 feet. All right, we had a whiff of zero one. On, sonar. Whoa, hello. Speaking of a whiff, there he is. I have you now. Lake one has followed. Thank you for the follow, sir. Good, good chatting with you already. I have you now. And blew the skid. Thanks for the follow. Yeah, really? You guys, <laughs> come on, I just started streaming as a Twitch affiliate and you're already busting my balls this hard? Quas Seabass says, you have a sister? And Red Rider says, that poor girl. Thanks, guys. Appreciate it. I'm glad I can count on Chad as backup. You guys are so evil. Alright, we barely, barely even hear this guy. Doesn't line up for an Akula, that's good. Doesn't line up for Sierra, that's also good. Alright, we have a Victor 2 or a Victor 1, it looks like. I think. Oh, maybe not. Actually, seeing that slight bulge on the front of his ship, on his boat, we're going to call it... Uh, we're going to call it a Tango. Sierra, 1. Is classified as submerged <laughs> submarine. <laughs> uh, Caked corrected them and said he has three sisters. Yes, I have three sisters. And Red Rider and I'm I'm the big brother, so I all of y'all stay away from my sisters. <laughs> Red Rider says, "Shut up, Outer Exodus. You know you love us." And I stand corrected, those poor girls. Really? Yeah, guys, come on. Be nice. 
<laughs> Blue the skin says, use the force kek. <laughs> uh, we're going to try to get a better solution on Tango. Helm come right full rudder, set your course 250 degrees. Seabass says, I have four. I feel your pain. Finally, some th sympathy around here. Appreciate it, Seabass. All right, we're going to speed up through this turn. Coming to 250 degrees. All right, give me a better solution. We have a shooting solution, folks. Helm, continue right full rudder. Make your course 290. Let's get within 30 degrees of his bearing so we can keep the wire on this torpedo. With him being this close, I would feel more comfortable having the wire. Passing 270. Five thousand yards. Yeah, he's close. All right, we're gonna have to come to three zero zero degrees. Blue the skid says, "Is that a shadow of a sub in the distance?" That is actually the sub that I have down here on the TAM track. TAM, TSM. Is it TSM or TAM? Oh my god, I can never remember. I think it's TSM. I don't know. All right, rudder amidships. All right, fire point procedure, Sierra 1 Tango, 2-5, bearing 327, range 3400 yards. Shoot 5. five. Torpedo room, firing 2-5. All right, let's see if he's smart enough to shoot back down the bearing. Yeah, that's the actual sub. Thank you, Seabass. Now, this guy might have a friend out there. Yep, blue the skid, you can actually uh, turn the 3D models off until you have a really good solution on the target, or you can just leave them on. Personally, I leave it on just because it makes for kind of a more exciting stream, I think. He didn't hear it. Hear what? What didn't I hear? Did I miss something? Oh, he might not have. Yeah, I, I, I get what you're saying, Seabass. <laughs> Hell yeah. Contact. Sierra, one, last he might not have heard it. That's three, a good point, Seabass. Ambient, or LE is at 111 decibels. Alright, no enemy vessels in the area. We're going to real quick take a look. Yep. The reason I knew this was a tango was because of this uh, awkwardly large hump on the bow of the boat. And if you go by... I love this little recognition manual they have. Tango, Foxtrot. Tango and Kilo are actually almost identical on their audio track. But visually you can kind of tell the difference. All right, nothing nearby. We're going to leave combat. It was just the Tango. Admiral says, excellent results, but unfortunately, this was not your mission objective. I kind of figured that one out. Thank you, Admiral. Blue the Skid says, by the way, I'm 20 and I watch Star Wars Rebels. I'm so proud I definitely don't eat potato chips while watching it. <laughs> we love random facts around here. So... Thank you for sharing the randomness. Trike boy, welcome to the stream. This is my first stream as a Twitch affiliate, so notice the cup down below, uh, which my sister has already graciously tried to fill, and Digital Pope has tried to fill with his Twitch Prime subscription. Trike boy, you're always welcome. Get back and push. <laughs> Uh, don't forget your uh, swimsuit, though. It, I hear it's kind of wet outside. Don't. <laughs> All right. This should be our target group. 
You're quite welcome. Ramming speed. <laughs> I doubt you can kick with your legs hard enough to get us that ramming speed there, to Trike. All right, they're bearing 089. Our heading is 150. They're about 60 degrees to our left. We should be in pretty good acquisition area. Strong thermal layer, so we will have a shadow zone to hide under or over. Ugh, and a very strong surface duct, so their sonar will carry pretty heavily above the layer. And we are at periscope depth, so this could actually be a bad position for us right now. Upscope, up ESM, we'll double check real quick. No, I thought uh, Eisenwolf says Star Wars Rebels is the only thing Disney has gotten right with the Star Wars universe. I thought they did a very good job on Rogue One. There were a couple, of, couple parts of it that were kind of questionable, but all in all, I think they did an excellent job with continuity with Rogue One. Towaway uh, says, I have two dedicated shelves for the one, for Star Wars zero, stuff, five, so you're not alone. Um, zero, oh, it's not right here. Uh, yeah. I have this guy. And this guy. And a whole box full of Star Wars Armada miniatures over in the other room. So, yes. Toway, I'm with you on the Star Wars stuff. <laughs> and then back behind me, which you might or might not be able to see on the table, is a two whole boxes full of Star Trek models. So, I'm a nerd through and through and very proud of it. We have five confirmed contacts. Seabass says Lord of the Rings beats Star Wars. What what world are you killing yourself in? That's just that doesn't make any sense there. Zero five bearing one zero four. Warship this bearing looks like it's a Krivac. Whoa, got a little bit of chug in there for a second. Classify him. Victor 6 as a crew. That's not even Sierra 5, so 6 confirmed targets. Where the hell is Sierra 5? Bearing 104. Ah, oh, crap. That means Sierra 5 is probably a sub. Looks like an alpha as well. Um, trying to match up the lines here. There we go. Yep. Sierra 5 is an alpha. Sierra 5 is classified as submerged submarine. <laughs> Stormer, you were... Red Rider, Stormer was wondering where you were. He was missing you. He says, where's my man crush Red Rider? He was... Stormer was lost without you. Uh, I'm going to get myself in trouble here pretty quick. All right, Sierra 1. Where the heck are you? Bearing 087. These guys are still a long ways away. This rain doesn't help. There he is. Sierra 7 looks to be an alligator. We'll get these classified real quick. Yep. Con Sonar Master 1 is classified as Merchant. Master 4, looks like a Rapucha. Yep. Con Sonar, Master 4, is classified as Merchant. And that looks like another alligator. Yep, another Con alligator. Sonar, Master 3, is classified and as And Master merchant. 2. No idea on that one right now. Oh, that's a cash -in. Con sonar right. master two Cash in is classified as escort. does not have any close in weapon systems. <laughs> I had Pizza Hut grill for me tonight, Red. Eisenwolf says I can go with Star Wars equals Lord of the Rings. I just pretend the prequels never yeah. I I 
I probably shouldn't say this, but I wrote several emails to Disney telling them they need to scrap the prequels and completely reshoot them. Because I thought they I thought they did an okay job with episode 7. And they kind of had to prove they could do a Disney movie, so they basically copied episode 4. But then they knocked it out of the park with Rogue One, so... I know Disney can make a Star Wars movie, so they need to just scrap the prequels and redo them. They can keep a few of the actors, like Samuel L. Jackson, Ewan McGregor was a great Obi-Wan. Keep Liam Neeson in for uh, Qui-Gon. Jar Jar die in a fire, yes. Actually, I think that would have actually been a better storyline if they, if uh, lower the Lucas remained with his actual idea of doing Darth Jar Jar. Trackboy says, no, I don't want to see a new version of prequels. Why not? The prequels are the worst Star Wars movies out there. Alright, we know that Alpha is right in front of us. Zero five, bearing one zero two. Right over there. Oh, baby girl. And little Princess Anna is talking ma 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 again. <laughs> they are the worst, but I don't need that story retold. But if it was a good story, you know, it would totally make up for it. I don't know. That's my thoughts. I want it. I want them redone. Outer Exodus, the vision visionary, yes. know about the Blue Milk special webcomic? I kind of don't want to know, and now I'm worried. Alright, we're going to harpoon the cash in. Con, sonar, master, oh, we kind of got to get rid of the Krivak first. Never mind. Sierra 5 is cavitating. Alright, we're still very unsure of the range of Sierra 5. 52% solution. Helm right full rudder, down full on ballast. Make your depth 100 feet. The amazing wooden boy playing Anakin didn't help in episode. Yeah. Yeah, just the prequels, prequels were just bad overall. Have you ever actually seen a whale in the game? I've only seen one. And yes, I did shoot it with a torpedo. I, you had to, right? You only, you're not going to see him very often. I had to shoot shoot it with a torpedo. Torp the whale? I did, yes. I did torp the whale. Tollway says, dang, that's a lot of ships. Not really. I've had <laughs> dick move since like one. I, I'm sorry. I had to, It's the only one I've ever seen. I had to see if it was possible. This, this was before... I watched Jive Turkey fail at shooting a whale with a torpedo. <laughs> Too bad you can't harpoon a whale. No, but I did harpoon a November class nuclear submarine the other day. That was pretty epic. Uh, nope. Alrighty, we. Ambient noise is at 97. So we're going to try to psych out this group a little bit. Fire control. Shoot. Tube 8. Moss. Bearing 97. Con. Torpedo room. Fire we're going to fire eight. mobile submarine simulator and see if we can't soak up those escorts on the Moss. Lake One says, in theory, if you catch a broaching with a harpoon. Yeah, I, I I shot the harpoon at what I thought was a surface ship. And after the harpoon hit, I went, I was ecstatic. It was a freaking November. It was excellent. And Red Rider says, Exodus, regarding the inevitable dozen torps headed your way, do or do not dodge. There is no try. 
<laughs> there won't be a dozen torps. They're all going to soak Tom, up on this moss. Room, tube, eight, and ready. I'm going to kill them all. That's basically how that goes. Ouch, caught him sun tanning. Yeah, I don't know why he was on the surface. It was actually pretty poor conditions out. And I had just sunk several ships and another November. Maybe, maybe he got scared and tried to hide on the surface. I don't know. Drake Boy says, The only good thing that came out of the Star Wars prequels was Weird Al Yankovic's The Saga Begins parody song. You have to admit, though, Ewan McGregor, as Obi-Wan, was the best part of the part of the prequels. He, he made an excellent Obi-Wan. Okay, basically right now we're going to see if... It was the communist Poland built November? No, it was a, it was the, a bunch of communist Frenchmen. No, no, I'm kidding, I'm kidding, I'm not going to insult the country. At least we know the sub wasn't Canadian. It would apologize to me for wrecking my torpedo. <laughs> I feel bad. I'm sorry, Canada. We love you. You're like the attic above a great party. <laughs> All right, we're going to do time compression a little bit here. Come on, Alpha. You know you want to eat that moss. Turn towards. Let's go. <laughs> Won't insult the country, but will torpedo a whale? Yeah. Whales don't have people living on board. Duh. Seriously, Alpha? A moss just went shooting by you, sounding like me, and you're going to ignore the damn thing. Fine. Absolutely fine. Fine, fine, fine. Left full rudder. Make your course one, 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 five. If the Alpha goes active, he'll have me detected. Tell that to Jonas. <laughs> Dang it. I thought for sure that Alpha would have soaked up on that, would have taken the bait of that moss. I can't believe he didn't. Alrighty, fire part procedure. Yep, we lost the Krivac, that's alright. Fire part procedure, Sierra 5 Alpha. Bearing 099, range to enable 3,800 yards. Shoot Come one. On, torpedo room, firing tube one. Fire control, watch that weapon. We don't want it. Yeah, Seabass says, knowing the Alpha Sonar, he probably wasn't even aware of it. Very possible. Definitely possible. All right, momentary pause here. I'm having this weird thought that thing isn't working correctly. We're going to go like this and like this. There. I feel better. And 4.9% dropped frames. Hmm. Alright, well, don't be shy, guys, of telling me if the stream drops or Twitch is out. <laughs> see, see what I did there? Twitch is out. I'm ashamed of myself. Hard to fool a blind man with a decoy? Yeah, pretty much. I'm hoping I waited long enough and our torpedo will not soak up on our own moss. Eisenwolf says, okay, the scary part, no active pinging by the Ruskies. As you said that, the Alpha started pinging. Which means, oh no, he sped up when he heard the torpedo. He still doesn't have me on active. He basically started pinging in order to see my torpedo. Okay, torpedo locked on. Alpha is speeding up, however. It's gonna be, a, might be a little bit before it finds him. 
And with that pinging, he alerted the, the other escorts. Looks like they're all pinging now. Con sonar regained contact on master six bearing one one zero. Good job, sonar. All right, we're gonna put a second torpedo on that Rapucha. No, why are you being that way, Torpedo? Zero, nine, seven. Fire control, steer the torpedo off of our moss, please. And thank you. Come on, so yes! Contact. Sierra five. Last Pretend they're all one zero four. <laughs> contact breaking up. Uh, Red Rider says, "I never do understand why you don't try to have multiple torps impact multiple escorts at once." You apparently missed last night when I had six torpedoes out at once in the water, and all six, oh no, five, and all five hit their targets. So, yes, I do, Red Rider. You apparently just left too early to see it last night. All right, Firepoint Procedure Master 2 cash in, bearing 056, range to enable 8,600 yards. Shoot two. Todd, torpedo room, firing tube two. Helm, left full rudder. Let's try to keep that torpedo, or keep the wire on that torpedo. And Master 8, bearing 108. Five point procedure, Master 8, Krivak 1, bearing 108, range to enable 11,100 yards. Shoot 6. Con, torpedo room, firing tube 6. And he's bearing 5 4. And there's the dog. Just wanted everybody to know she's still alive. Alright, rudder amidships. One second, guys. Alrighty. <laughs> Red Rider, it is to a dog. It's just a small dog. <laughs> Her name was Lola. <sighs> You're never going to let that rest. Just because my dog's name is Lola and she's a four pound Chihuahua minpin. Alright, we're going to speed up a little bit. Give me one second again. <laughs> Almost missed Master 2 because I was not paying attention. Enabled it just in time, however. And where the heck are you? Con sonar lost con we got Master, Master 2. two. Last bearing, zero. And Five. this guy, two. once we're safely up. past the wreck of the Alpha, we're going to enable. Alrighty. And now we got the whole family over. So pardon the noise, guys. Everyone wants to come see the babies. <laughs> Track Boy says, Cold Water is the game that plays itself when you can't. Where is that? Right, we got all Master known six, escorts. One, one, three. Contact right Alrighty, up. fire point procedure. Master four Rapucha, tube three missile, bearing zero eight seven, range one four, one hundred yards. 
Tube Con, three. Torpedo room. Fine. Tube three. And five point procedure master three. Bearing zero six three. Range two one seven hundred yards. Shoot. Con, torpedo room. Firing two four. Missile away. Very hard to see anything at this point. See if we can't see the uh, explosion explosion from the other Rapucha. Con sonar lost contact. Master four. Nope. Last there it was. Zero. Eight, <laughs> seven, My angling was bad. Ein Charlie, welcome to the stream. How's it going tonight? Hope you're having a good night. We're going pretty good here, and I may have told that to go out too far. Yep. Told it to go out too far. Dang it. Alright, let's try that again. Enabling a little bit closer here. Bearing zero five point procedure master three, bearing zero six four, range one nine seven hundred yards. Con, torpedo room, firing two seven. <laughs> nope. No one's managed it yet, Red Rider. I got it, Eisenwolf. I got it. Thanks for the reminder, though. <laughs> Toy says I would pay for that. <laughs> we do take requests. That's not a screw up, Seabass. What the heck? More importantly, why did the bot not do it? <gasps> the bot closed itself. Why did the bot close itself? Sorry for the pause, guys. I did not kill it. I didn't. I don't know why it closed either. There we go. I fixed it. 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 Oh yeah, Red Rider, we have a bot now. Thanks to Seabass. Alright, well, as soon as Con, we get a harpoon room, reloaded. Tube one ready. Con, torpedo room, two, two ready. The bot basically keeps track of my screw ups. Con, torpedo room, two, so three ready. Anytime I screw up really bad, do exclamation point screw up. What, what is that? Just because I closed the bot window by accident doesn't mean anything. All right, fire point procedure, master one alligator, bearing 088, range 16800 yards. Shoot Con, three. Torpedo room, firing tube three. Con, torpedo room, tube four ready. <laughs> Red Rider. <laughs> we are trying to keep the stream a little bit more friendly. It has one that's, uh, what did we do? Point scope? Is that what that is? For when I rip off a periscope. Um, I don't even remember what all it does. So you've asked what all does it do. Let everyone know what it does. So they can enjoy in the fun as well. Con, torpedo room, two, six ready. Looks like we got master one. Got master one. Master bearing zero eight five. Contact breaking up. Alrighty, looks like we got all targets. We did indeed. Wonder if that was actually our group. That was not our group. Hopefully this is our group. <laughs> My baby's still going ma ma ma. <laughs> Periscope depth is now sticking the min pins head out the window. That's just cruel. <laughs> also accurate. Right, let's reload these tubes here. 
And close to 10,000 yards. They're bearing 6.9. Weak thermal layer at 146 feet. Are heading 357. So they're basically 70 degrees to our starboard. Red Rider, it is a dog. It is a dog. Um, right full rudder, set your course zero one zero. And my baby's just talking away. Silent running, ma, 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 yeah, pretty much. <laughs> uh, ultra quiet. <laughs> All right, let's classify some targets here. Possible Krivak. Yep. Zero one's a Krivak. One is classified Zero as four. Escort. What the heck are you? Cashin? No, cannon. Con sonar. Sierra four is classified as Zero escort. three alligator. Yep. Con sonar. Sierra three. Zero two. Is Rapucha. As this, looks, this seems like an awfully small group as well. Up scope, up ESM. Haha, <laughs> just kid, really, just kidding. Rig family for ultra quiet. <laughs> yeah, I tried. Con sonar, new contact bearing. <laughs> Is it Zero bad if eight. I think my baby One. sounds like a tauntaun? <laughs> Uh, I feel bad now. <laughs> Master 4 Cannon. You're already... There we go. Alright, get some accurate ranges on these guys and we'll go from there. Sierra 5 is probably another submerged submarine. Not much of a clue on classification, however. That's not good. See, uh, uh, who said later? Trike Boy, gotta run. Happy hunting. We'll have to catch the replay. Thanks for tuning in. Have a great night, Trike Boy. <laughs> Needs the cone of silence. <laughs> Red Rider says, I have criteria for what isn't anything that bounces. Okay, you're ba now you're just quoting Jeff Dunham. That doesn't count. Oh, Sierra 5, we're going to classify you tentatively. We're going to go worst case scenario Con and say sonar. Sierra 2. Sierra 5 is classified as submerged submarine. I doubt it's actually a Sierra 2. Yes, it's still funny. But my dog is not terrified by a running leap. Thank you very much. And yes, it's a dog. Oh, technically that Sierra is the threat. If it is a Sierra 2, bearing 083. He's still a ways out there, it looks like. Should be dead ahead right there. Not seeing anything. We got active pings in the water. Digital pulp. Come on. <laughs> Five point procedure, Master One Krivak. Bearing zero seven zero range one two four hundred yards. Shoot one. one. Torpedo room. Firing two one. 
Firepoint Procedure Master 4 Cannon. Bearing 096, range 15,900 yards. Shoot six. Room. Helm Not right full rudder. Zero, zero two is cavitating. We're gonna scare the crap out of him. We're gonna bracket him with torpedoes. One moment. <laughs> no, keep my daughter talking. She's she's adorable. At Digital Pope, will you give me Digital Eucharist? What? what the heck is Digital Eucharist? See, Bess, you're always using terms I don't know what they are. <laughs> Helm, rudder amidships, we'll hold here. We should be able to keep both wires. All right, I'm going to put a torpedo out searching for that Sierra. Firepoint procedure, Sierra 5, Sierra 2, bearing 084, range 3,600 yards. Shoot Tom, two. Torpedo room, firing tube two. Wire clearance complete, torpedo running good. Oh, he's like burning right at me. I see him now. He's right in front of me. That's Nakula. Con sonar, Sierra five. Is God, he's running straight at me. Submarine. No, sh no shit's given by this guy. Stick Bernard, welcome to the stream. Says it's basically just a question. Our Eucharist. They put two fingers in the child, you know you found what? I'm so confused. So confused. I'm I'm a Presbyterian. We stayed away from anything that was remotely Catholic. <laughs> we left the old world because of the Catholic. Alright. Torpedo has acquired the Sierra 5. Alright, let's check on one. Where do we have an activation? There we go. Let's change his enable point, and we'll check to torpedo six. Change his enable point as well, including the family size. <laughs> Clockboy99, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the stream. Hope you're having a good night. I'm having a good night. Got a bunch of family over, as you can all probably hear. And my daughter is constantly so saying "mama" because she Sierra likes "mama" five, instead of "daddy." Zero, eight, two, so, contact breaking oh well. Stick Bernard says, JK, and sorry for unlurking. <laughs> no, please, remain unlurked. You just unlurked with suddenly an explanation of something I had no idea about. <laughs> just unlurk with something nerdy next time, only not Catholic Church nerdy. We're good, we're good, don't worry about it. And Stick says, this game looks so cool. It is, I love love cold waters it's a lot of fun it's been years since there's been a really good modern submarine simulator and cold waters is doing a pretty dang good job hmm monkey shoulder monkey sh what the heck is monkey shoulder never <laughs> see best says you're catholic well i'm sorry more like i'm sorry for your knees i couldn't i couldn't i could not do a service <laughs> sonar, lost we got Krivak 1. Hell yeah. There goes the threat of SSN-14 or cruise missile assisted torpedoes. Very happy to see that threat go away. And now with just the cannon remaining, we will go harpoon on these transports, butts. So, firepoint procedure, Master 3 alligator, tube 3 missile, bearing 075, range 21,100 yards. Shoot Tom, three. Torpedo room. Firing Fire point procedure three. master two. Rapucha bearing zero eight two range nineteen thousand yards. Shoot Tom, four. Torpedo room. Firing two four. Outer Exodus. We're talking Scotch over here. Oh. Okay. Fair enough. 
<laughs> I had I had no idea. So we're gonna watch as this guy sinks. And hopefully That was cool. Everybody hear our missile just fly past? That was cool. Con sonar lost contact. Master four. Master four Last is zero. dead. Nine. Right Three. there. Wow. Contact breaking up. And these transports should be off in that a direction. Con sonar yeah, lost there's contact. one. Master. There's two. Hell yeah. One escort active. Nope. Yeah. <laughs> Never mind, says Eisenwolf. <laughs> uh, nothing nearby. We're going to leave combat. That was the whole group there. Probably not. Yeah. Good job, but this was not your mission objective. I figured. It was too small. To and there's subs. I did not need submarines right now. I'm looking for a landing group. Um... Let's see here. Eisenwolf and Digital Pope, if you guys can send me a whisper on Twitch, I'd like to send you an invite to my brand new fledgling Discord. Just in case you need to ask me specifically a question or want to specifically talk to me at all. Um, Eisenwolf for being a loyal moderator and Digital Pope for being my first subscriber. If you guys can send me a whisper, I'll get back to you with an invite code. Assuming you guys, Digital Pope, I'm pretty sure you're on uh, Jives, but I think Eisenwolf is too, but oh well. Alright, let's reload the tubes before we enter, or Real King of Norway, who isn't here, would probably tear me a new one. We're going to load another moss there. There we go. I like that loadout. Close to 10,000 yards. Rig ship for ultra quiet. Won't stay very, very quiet. We're hunting rabbits. Zero six. All right, what do we got? What do we got? Thankfully, not an Akula or looks like a Kilo almost. Nope, it's another Tango. God bless it. I hate these diesel electric subs. They're just everywhere. Submerged submarine. Pearlstormer says, you've got a new Patreon. Do I? Pardon the pause in the thing. I should check that. I wish I could integrate baby noises with Patreon. <laughs> oh, man. Happy babies are fun. <laughs> Notifications. Oh, thank you very much, Hurl Stormer. Thank you for being my second Patreon, and thank you. Thank you, thank you. You guys, it means a lot. I just, I just enjoy, I really just enjoy the, uh, the whole interaction between each, between you guys and me. So, integrate them for the, ooh, that's a good point. Seabass, Seabass, yes. <laughs> you guys are already, you guys are on top of things. I, I'm just going to sit here and play the game. You guys are on top of it. So, thank you. Every, thank you, Seabass. Thank you, Pope. Thank you, Stormer. You guys are still talking scotch over there. Nice. I like I like your guys' thoughts there. I used to be a scotch and whiskey drinker, but that was almost a decade ago, last time I had a, any of them. There he is, right there. We have a 79% solution. That is a shooting solution, and I will take advantage of it. Firepoint procedure, CR1, Tango, Tube 1. Bearing 072, range 8,000 yards. Shoot Five, 1. Torpedo room, firing Tube 1. Uh, Seabass, maybe make it like... Uh, exclamation point, patro or patron... P A T R O N. Just a loud mama every time there's something incoming. <laughs> I still need to get some kind of uh, 
integrate something with OBS where I could just press a button and like a picture of my baby's face flashes on screen and says baby difficulty mode activated with like red alert klaxons or something going on. For those of you who are here that have not seen baby difficulty mode, it's when my wife lets has me hold my child, my 10 month old daughter, while she gets ready for bed. And normally it involves a couple broken ribs, a few choke outs, and possibly losing my glasses and headset. <laughs> While trying to avoid torpedoes one handed. <laughs> Baby difficulty mode is a crowd favorite around here. <laughs> Stick Bernards asks, what goes what all goes into plotting a solution? It's not just an intercept vector. No, it's not. Um well, first off, you're, you need a decent solution on the target in order to get his bearing, which direction he's going, his range, etc., and his speed. And then, because all of these torpedoes are wire-guided and they're smart torpedoes, you don't necessarily have to fire directly in front of them, like where they're going to be. You can kind of... I'm sorry, Red just completely stole my train of, sh train of thought there. Uh, um, scary. Very scary. Um, yeah, since they're smart torpedoes and they're wire-guided, if you keep the angle of the torpedo about 30 degrees from your bow, you're able to keep the wire, which is what the symbol down here means. I still have a wire connected from my ship to the torpedo, so I'm able to steer it. But sonar basic sonar and fire control basically do all the calculations for you on the solution of the target you just have to not be dumb where you shoot it as long as you shoot it and it's within this little cone here it will the torpedo will normally acquire the target and home in on its own now in the 1968 campaign you basically have a lot of dumb fire torpedoes in that case let's see if i yep when i select a torpedo the fire control here, the fire or the solution plot, gives me a little circle with a dot. And if this were a dumb fire torpedo, that is where my uh, weapons officer says shoot the torpedo there to hit the target, which is completely useless if the target turns or slows down or speeds up. So be very happy we have smart torpedoes. Looks like we have an acquisition. The wire, yeah, like a toe. Exactly, Stick Bernard. Red Rider says I'll keep it PG-13. Uh, sonar, Sierra, one. Thank you, Red Rider. I appreciate it. See, I'm a purist. Dumb fire torpedoes are the way forward. Yeah. How the hell would you hit an enemy torp with a dumb torp? Enemy sub? You wouldn't. That's why there were basically no sub-to-sub -sub engagements before the invention of uh, self-guided torpedoes. Back then they used the force. <laughs> Stick Bernard, I like you. You're welcome. You're welcome around here whenever you want to show up. <laughs> uh, what school did the Toros go if they're not <laughs> Toros? I'm sure you mean Torps. <laughs> Con, sonar, lost they probably went to zero, my high school, one, actually. Last bearing zero six. All right, no other vessels nearby. It was probably. God, I hate the groups that are just a freaking tango. Basically, a waste of a torpedo on those old subs. Because they're never going to hear me, and they're just, they just take up space. All right, red sub sunk. So far, so good. Admiral's going to tell me that wasn't your mission objective again. Ooh, 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 ooh. I like these replenishment tankers mission, because there's a good chance there could be, could be a capital ship in this group. So they're leaving, <laughs> and there's the baby. They're leaving Archangel momentarily for a rendezvous near the Greenland Sea. Reload tube one. And continue on course. We're going to head up here and... Okay, I was going to say, did the game sound suddenly cut out? Now it came back. That's good. Okay, we're going to wait right back. Oh, crap. All right, everyone in the area is now going to be heading to try to intercept me because that maritime patrol aircraft just spotted me. We're going to be quiet and see if we can hear anyone incoming. That would be replenishment for the Russian forces at Narvik. Yep. Alright, this might... Ooh. This, this one's probably our target. 
We're going to sit here and wait. Hopefully I released the mouse button before we engaged. I did not. So we're going at a full bell. Fry school, says Stick Bernard. Yeah. Uh, Red Rider says, I have Wolves of the Pacific. So fun. Yes, Wolves, the Silent Hunter series are a lot of fun. <laughs> Good one, Stick Bernard. Silent Hunter 4 is a great game, but I wanted a Japan campaign. That would have been fun. Pearl Stormer says stream is buffering a bit. Hmm. All right, that's not good. Let's double check. Looks like it just bounced back. Did it st did it steady out again, guys? Do it okay now? Okay. Not sure why it dropped down like that. Oh! <laughs> oh, Steam, you think you're funny, do you? Steam just tried to upload or update a video game. Let me turn that off real quick. And we're good. Okay. <laughs> uh, sorry about that, guys. <laughs> Red Rider. If I wanted FPS this low, I'd be using a console. <laughs> you, sir, are getting pretty good at this whole ball busting thing. I've seen worf, worse buffering, to be honest. Well, I still like to try to keep it up. Rig ship for ultra quiet. And nobody turned that into a dirty joke. I thought of that after the fact. Okay. Sonar, give me a contact. Chaos Sphere, welcome to the stream, buddy. Chaos Sphere, this is my on, first so stream being a Barry. Twitch affiliate, one, four, hence eight, no longer seven, streaming eight, on zero, YouTube. One. But also hence the uh, cup you see down below on, and on, the ticker Barry. over on the side one, with three, any and all one, donations. Designated zero, two. Good to see you, Chaos. Con, sonar, new what, what's Barry. your, I'm, a, I'm afraid seven, to ask, but seven, what's your tonnage zero, record up three. to currently? Did you start another campaign and get past three million this time? That was sarcasm in case you weren't sure. All right, zero, one, and two. Let's, um, Ugra. Sonar, Sierra, one, is classified Princess as Anna. Hi, baby girl. <laughs> oh, That smile is evil. That smile is very evil. She's only 10 months old. She's not supposed to know how to tie me around her finger already. All right, this is a Grisha. Con, sonar, zero two, zero, Grisha two, three. Classified as escort. Chaos Rear says, "Congrats, sir. Yeah, thank you. Tonnage record is still 2.23 million. HMS Ajax is still king. Dang it." Red Rider says, "Engage baby difficulty. Do it. No. <laughs> that no." Red Rider wants baby difficulty, and he's a jerk, so we don't give Red Rider what he wants. Baby difficulty mode. Passing 600 feet. <laughs> All right, everybody say hi to Princess Anna. This is going to get difficult. Hi, baby girl. Can you wave? Can you wave? Huh? Can you wave? Okay. Uh, ouch. And all ready for the ribs, really, girl? I'm still recovering from ribs last night. Uh, Red Rider says, I win. Yes, Red Rider, you get baby difficulty one. Hi, baby. Here. Here. Passing 500 feet. Play with Daddy's Hot Pocket case. Yeah. Oh, Hot Pockets are amazing. Daddy's a genius. <laughs> okay. Hi, baby. You're so cute. Yes, you are. Yes, you are. <laughs> uh, he's going to die. No, I'm not. I am going to live. I'm going to live. All right, we're going to speed up Passing as we go up to periscope feet. depth. Passing 300 feet. Passing 200 feet. Passing 100 feet. Oh, shoot. Okay, stop rising. Don't go up any further. Just stop. Frozen and molten. 
Stick Bernard, can she say Los Angeles class submarine yet? <laughs> All right, I don't know. Let's see, baby girl. Here, here. Can you say attack submarine? Sea wolf. Say sea wolf. Ma ma ma. Where's mommy? There she is. <laughs> And that is caked behind me, the crazy woman who donated some bits. Ouch! <laughs> God! Oh! Ow! God, stay off the rib, please! Okay, up scope, up PSM. <sighs> and much like Schrodinger's cat, their temperature is a superposition of both frozen and nuclear hot. Yes. <laughs> Squeam, stream quality is bouncing about. Oh, come on. I don't need baby difficulty mode and bad streaming right now. Every time I alt-tab out, it seems to be stable. Looks like there was a drop to 71 kilobits per second a minute ago. Oops. Followers only mode? It shouldn't be on followers only mode. Is it on followers only mode? It's not supposed to be. No, it's not on followers only mode. Oh! I was going to say, I don't think Stick Bernard is a follower yet. Oh, this hurts. Oh, no, what are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing? Oh, you're playing with Kayla. Ah. Kay uh, Okay, so everything's good. Let's find these ow targets. Oh. I have you now. Oh, well, that's weird. <laughs> and there's Stick Bernard following. Crap, I'm not following. No, that's all right, Stick. No worries. Um, Master Three bearing one seven seven. Kayla, you're killing my arm here. <laughs> oh, God. Okay, you're switching arms, baby girl. Oh, <laughs> she doesn't want to switch arms. Oh, man. Oh, so painful. Oh. Don't drop. <laughs> Come here. <laughs> there, look over the side. <laughs> Oh, why can I not see Master Three? Master Three. Bearing one seven seven. Oh, oh hi! Oh, you're closer than I would have thought. Oh God! Uh, she is my crypt. She got her feet are like knives. It's really bad. This is a ca ow so cannon. Baby girl. Oh god. <laughs> oh god, she uses my lower rib as a springboard. Oh, baby girl. Okay, we're bringing you back to the other side. That was not good. <laughs> oh, ouch. That was rather painful. Okay. Where are the other two targets? Um, I have you now. 122. Oh, did I do an Ohio? I did do an Ohio. What the hell? 122. Mm. There you are. And there you are. Ouch! <laughs> Captain Pork Sword says, "Yep, even vodka can't numb that pain." I gotta see who did the follow here, quick. Sorry, guys. Oh, Red Rider followed. You hadn't followed yet, man. You're a slacker. You didn't realize you're a slacker, right? 
Hi, baby girl. Oh, did you drop it? Did you drop it? Here, there's your Eeyore. Yeah, there's your Eeyore. Yeah. Alright. Torpedo room. What? No, 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 no. Did you hit the space button? Did you hit the space bar? <sighs> Alright, well, if I wanted to broadcast my position, <laughs> I just broadcasted my position. Ouch. Oh, dear. <laughs> um... Okay, let's get some torpedoes in the water, shall we? I'm not going to call it fire point procedures right now. Oh, Crap. Firing two one. Um. Con, torpedo room. Firing tube six. Ah, oh, you're standing on my rib, girl. <laughs> oh God, you are extremely painful. You're getting tired, aren't you? Yeah. It's okay. Yeah, pretty cool. Huh? Can you choke a little bit? Yeah. Ow! And Tom, one there. Computer room, firing two five. Oh. You could always clip her nails. It's not her nails that make her feet like daggers. Yeah, it's just your natural shape of your feet. Okay, okay, there you go. There, there's the headset to play with. Launch everything you got and run. Ow! Okay. Ow. Um, uh. What the heck are you doing, baby girl? Daddy is trying to sink Soviet ships. Oh. No, not the glasses. <laughs> you are so destructive. Really? That's that's my tongue. Uh huh. Yep. Good job. What have you been eating? Kind of got a little up. Oh, okay. Ow! That's my tongue, baby girl. Uh, <laughs> ouch! God! Oh! Oh, no, 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 no. You don't need to play with the pop can. John Sonar, noisemaker, bearing. One, How am I not one, detected four. yet? Um, pork sword, I'm not detected because ambient noise is 91. And I'm about 15,000 kilometers from all these targets. And all of them have really crappy sonars. Ugh. There, did I fix his head that? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Play with Eeyore some more. Here he goes. Come on, come on. <laughs> uh, as destructive as she's it as she is, it's she's too cute for her own good. Oh my God! I picked up all three targets on those quick snapshots. Fifteen thousand. Did I say fifteen thousand? Oh my God. <laughs> 15,000 yards. Con, sonar, we got on. the Grisha. Master, two, last bearing, one, one, nine. Contact breaking up. Um, where's the cannon? 192. Con, sonar, lost contact. Master, Cannon's three, dead. Last bearing, one, nine, three. Contact breaking up. And we're closing in on the Ugra, bearing 118. Ah, 
on, she's climbing my ribs. Oh. One, last bearing. One, one, eight. Attack breaking up. Oh, I'm gonna have to catch up on chat here in a moment, guys. Hi, baby girl. Hi, baby. What are you doing? Huh? What are you doing? That's it. Watch, watch the destruction of the Soviet ships. Yep. Watch. See? Look. See over here. See him? <laughs> okay. See, Bess says he's back. Firefox crashed. That's why I don't use Firefox. Ow! Was well, only those three contacts. Hell yeah. <sighs> Legion of Merit Medal. Look, look at Daddy's bling. See Daddy's bling? That's shiny and colorful, huh? Really? Ow. All right, so we got bling. <laughs> Are you waving at everybody in the other room? Are you waving at everybody in the other room? <sighs> Posthumously? Wait, wait, wait. No, I'm not dead. I'm not dead. I did not die. Alright. Wolf pack of enemy attack submarines. That hurts. Alright, let's reload tubes. <laughs> While the baby cont continues climbing my ribs. Oh, man. Did it say posthumously? Well, I didn't die. <laughs> We're still in the USS Connecticut. Ow! Oh, have mercy on me, baby girl. <laughs> Ouch. All right, who wants a baby? Anybody want a baby? Oh. Bug report. Yep. Ouch. All right. Bearing one, two, five. We're going quiet. We're going to close in. You <laughs> You're supposed to say daddy. Oh, man. I tell you, I get punished. Mommy gets all the glory. Upscope. Raise the ESM mass. Ouch. Ouch. God. All right. Come up to four or five feet. Oh, man. Ow. What's up? What do you see? No, no pop cans. <laughs> All right, guys. <laughs> We're going to take one minute and take a real quick break, and then I'll be right back. <laughs> Bear with me. <laughs>
overwhelming force of the baby. You guys, you guys don't have any faith in me. Come on. <laughs> oh. I'm not gonna lie, baby difficulty mode is pretty difficult. <laughs> oh. All right, switch to low light. She tires you out pretty dang quick though. That looks like a Kara. Why does that look like a Kara? I don't like Karas. They have SSN 14s. Might be a Cresta 2. Yep, Cresta 2. Master That's a big boat. Classified as escort. That's a big ship. Any other contacts? Only the Cresta 2 right now. Any other visual contacts in range? See, baby's unhappy. She's not beating up on her father anymore. <sighs> Never mind, I was wrong. It says to away. Uh, well, thank you for admitting it. I'm still alive. The rumors of my death have been greatly exaggerated. To quote the only true Star Trek captain, Captain Picard. Okay, I'm not seeing any other nearby contacts. Unless... Warship this bearing Mark. Victor 2, I got nothing on him. It's not another cash in or Cresta 2. I, I can't hear anything on him. have to give it to her. She is an aggressive captain. <laughs> She's a very aggressive cap captain. Uh, Alright, I'm going to take a moment here and catch up on chat that I missed <laughs> while I was in baby difficulty mode. Uh, just had a sort of surreal moment since Pythos. I come into stream and hear... Mm, and then advertisement with a potato that says advertisement comes up. What? Weird. Made a career out of doing the minimum possible work. Oh, and you guys are laughing at my pain. That's that's great. That's super. An unforced error. <laughs> did you did you really do a screw up on that uh, on the baby launch? Yeah, he did. He did a screw up on the baby launch. Yeah. Pity you didn't say first. Did the baby really launch a harpoon? Yes, the baby really launched a harpoon. Uh, force cloak. <laughs> no baby for red. Come on, Red Rider, you don't want to do any baby difficulty mode? Uh, and we're caught up. All right. <laughs> All right, Master 2. We have contact on ESM on Master 2 now. Bring 109. Where the hell did it go? That's the Cresta 2. Oh, he's behind it now. God, he's way out there. All right. Down scope. Down scope. Lower the ESM mast. We're going to put a torpedo into Master 1. Firepoint procedure, Master 1, Cresta 2, bearing 089, range 6, 700 yards. Shoot one. one. Torpedo room, firing 2-1. <laughs> Red Rider says, OE, the toys in the garage say I'm staying away from the bedroom forever if possible. <laughs> uh, but babies are a lot of fun. I wouldn't trade her in for anything. Or any amount of anything. Uh, my ribs wouldn't mind a break from time to time, though. One, zero, six. Oh, of course it would be an Udaloy. Master two is classified Crap. as escort. 
That is definitely a Nodaloy. No other Russian ship has this ridiculous bow sonar. God, that's insane. And really loud. Holy cow. Pork Sword says, Man, I wish Jive was here on dis was here on Discord to hear about him bust a gut in your pain. Yeah, no, no. Jive has already seen baby difficulty mode several times and was about as forgiving as you guys are. <laughs> oh, man. All right. So that Udaloy has no clue we're here. The crest of two beam between us is helping keep me hidden. And the 108 decibel noise, or surface noise, is also helping keep me hidden. <laughs> Digital Pope. Yes, give Red Rider all the shit you can. Come on, he deserves it. Way more than I do. I'm just here, playing a game, trying to, you know, politely chat with you people. And Red Rider comes in, and then and then this, and then and then that. And hey, let's drink this, and hey, I don't want to baby that. Alright, we did acquire the crest of two. We're going to put one torp out on the Oodaloy. Firepower Procedure Master 2, Tube 2. Bearing 094 range, 16,100 yards. Shoot to torpedo room, firing tube two. Flying torpedo. See if we get flying torpedo again before it impacts. Oh, come on. No more flying torpedo. Ah, flying torpedo. That's really satisfying when I see ships that have freaking SSN 14s die. Is that bad of me? Red Rider says, I seem to think we're all having a lot of fun over here when I show up. And don't worry, if you want to toss the ball busting back, I'm more than happy to take what I dish out. Good man. Good man. If you can't take it, you shouldn't dish it out. So I'm glad you can take it. Oh, man. We're going to speed up a little bit. Why is that what I think it is? Ah! I saw a helo. I did. I did see a helo. Launch the stingers. God, I wish, pistol. Welcome to the stream, by the way. Feel free and join in the ball busting like everyone else has. Or if you're feeling kinder, throw a bit in the cup. <laughs> I've helped me pay for my medical bill after all the abuse I've been receiving. Ugh. All right, where's the Udaloy again? Bearing 098. All right, so Udaloy is closing. Where's my torpedo? The hell is the wreck of the Cresta? Oh, there it is. Oh, that was close. All right, where did that Hilo end up? the helo there that is the helo there bearing zero six or zero five eight <laughs> hello this is boris friendly russian helicopter says seabaz <laughs> all right he is 
closing. Fire control, enable the torpedo. Go away, go away. You see nothing. Rig ship for ultra quiet. Raise the ESM mast. <laughs> Digital Pope, he's just a new new Amazon delivery drone. <laughs> uh, if only. Wow, we got there just in time, didn't we? Really thankful it was as noisy as it was out, otherwise this could have been a lot dicier. Okay. Where did that helo go? There you are. Bearing zero four zero. Helm left full rudder. Nope, sorry, right full rudder. Make your course 220. We're going to speed up a little bit through the turn. Oh, ship. Oh, Let's ship. Go. Con, sonar. Torpedo in the water. Torpedo in the water. Bearing. Passing 500 feet. Well, then. Torpedo evasion. Passing 600 feet. Passing 700 feet. Passing 800 feet. Passing 900 feet. Passing 1,000 feet. Passing 1,100 feet. Passing 1,200 feet. Left full rudder. Knuckle Get the, form. Oh no, right full rudder. All rise on the planes, all rise by ballast. Bring us above this torpedo. Passing 1200 feet. How is this? This is the first torpedo. Passing 1100 feet. Passing 1000 feet. Stay right full. Hey, you guys cannot say that was a screw up. I didn't screw up. I didn't get hit with a torpedo. Blew the skid. Welcome back. I'm being shot at. <laughs> Con, knuckle form. There we go. Where the hell? A second torpedo's right above me. Great. All right, left full rudder. All rise Con, on the plane. All form. up ballast. Passing Bring us above this torpedo. Passing 700 feet. Passing 600 feet. Passing 500 feet. Con, knuckle form. Passing right full rudder. Feet. Passing 600 feet. Passing 700 feet. Passing 800 feet. Passing 900 feet. Passing 1,000 feet. <sighs> Passing 1,100 feet. Passing. And where feet. goes one? All right, come back. Left full uh, rudder. Form. Get the torpedo behind us. <laughs> uh, Digital Pope, can you imagine how many ads he's going to have to run to pay for a noodle <laughs> uh, A couple, maybe. I'm actually going to try really hard and not run any ads during any of my streams. I I don't know. I, I find it kind of cheesy. If you guys want to support me, you'll support me. I don't need to force you to watch any crap other than the stuff Twitch already makes you watch. So, yes. Other than the one when you first join the channel that Twitch forces you to watch, unless you're a Twitch Prime member, I will not be running any ads on any of my streams. 
Take that to the bank, gentlemen. Aircraft still nearby. Alright, we're just gonna go to time compression and outrun this helo. Probably should have. Oh, excuse me. Gee, to stop closing the bot. I, I'm not closing the bot. The bot window is closing on its own. So you might want to look into that. But yes, the bot window is closing on its own. Not sure why. Link deleted. Even if I go to piss no ads, asked Blue this kid. Nope, I'll just go to my uh, stream will resume shortly window and I won't force you guys to watch any ads. Like I said, if you guys if you guys want to support me, I want to make it completely optional. You guys can if you want. There's bits. There's my donation button. There's Patreon. I got plenty of ways you guys can support me if you want. If not, just all I ask is you speak up and chat and we can have some conversations All right. oh another replenishment group shoot missed it I don't even know what our mission is at this point I've fought so many intercepts uh, wolf pack all right we're gonna ignore a wolf pack I don't I don't really care about a wolf pack I want to find something dangerous in the Barren Sea. Let's get let's get dangerous, shall we? It's probably a Union bot. <laughs> uh, that's pretty funny. ACA Hawk, good evening. Welcome back to the stream. Hope you're having a good night. How do I give bits? Isn't that free? Bits bits can be free if you choose to watch a whole bunch of ads. But no, bits are uh, on iPad. So it's the little diamond sim symbol next to the chat box. But yeah, they're not they're not free. So like I said, if you want to support, feel free. If you don't or can't, just be in here, and I'm appreciative. Yeah, better than yesterday. Cheese today is a calm night. That's good to hear, ACA. Oh, crap. Everyone and their mother. Oh, no, we're going 28 knots. We're going to close to 15,000 yards then. Reload all the tubes. Looks like 100 bits equals 140. Yeah, I'm not... I'm not... I think... And I'm not sure what they are, because I, uh, although I should, I bought a bunch and gave some to uh, Fat Planet, who is hosting right now. So thank you, Fat Planet. All right, close to 15,000 yards. Toei, you definitely don't need to feel like you have to. Big ship for I'm just happy you're here talking. It's so much nicer to play games when you're not all alone. <laughs> ah. In euros, it's one cent for ten bits. Well, that's not bad. All right, come on, we're coming quiet. Give me a contact. Somebody intercepted us. Con, sonar, new Holy contact, Jesus! One nine three designated Sierra one. Oh hi. Hi, ah, oh, you little jackass, what are you doing over there? Oh, it's in the sick neck. Crap. Con sonar, new contact bearing. Great, another one. Well, it's not an Akula, that's good. It's a Victor 2. Con sonar, Sierra 1. Is classified and Sierra as 2 is an alpha. Con sonar. Interesting. Sierra 2 is classified as submerged submarine. <laughs> it always throws me off when you do that Ohi thing, Seabass. You'll have to do it again because I remember there being another one. 
louder wanted excitement, which granted. Uh, yeah, I know that feeling playing alone in front of Nota audience. Yeah. Digital Pope says, ha, huh, Koroks are so cute in BOTW. Fill me in, Digital Pope. What's the acronym stand for? I should probably know it. I feel bad. Okay. Um, Victor 2 is definitely the threat. If the Victor 2 goes active, he will spot us precisely. You know what? Sonar, give me one active ping. I need a range. Con Sonar, switching to active search. Oh, come on! ACA says uh, the Switch Zelda game. Well, I have, uh, I haven't played Zelda since Nintendo 64. ACA says, uh, yeah, I've started streaming recently. I get the feeling it's a bit awkward, but it's okay. <laughs> I, I was really nervous my first one, but it was, it got pretty natural pretty fast. It's a lot nicer when you have people actually chatting in chat because you don't feel like you're just sitting here talking to a camera. Red Rider with the five bits. <laughs> Thank you, Red Rider. <laughs> uh, you're a good man. Let it never be said you're in good man. Delith Delithia. I hope I'm saying that right. Chat? What is chat? <laughs> well, welcome to the stream. And yes, chat, that thing you do on the computer to other people on the computer. Don't take that the wrong way. ACA says, yeah, I don't do webcams, so that feels a bit less awkward then. <laughs> That's all good. I turned off adblock for that. <laughs> so you actually went and watched an ad for five free bits to give me five free bits. <laughs> oh, Red Red, <laughs> you're a jackass, but I love you. <laughs> Uh, Del Delithia says there are other people here. I don't believe you. I know, I know. It's, I mean, it's really just me here. All the other people are imaginary on my little iPad screen here. Okay, fire point procedure CR1 Victor 2. Tube 5 bearing 240 range 2200 yards. I want that to be active. Shoot Todd 5. Torpedo room firing 25. We are no people, we are bots. Poorly programmed bots at that. Ah! Oh, Red Rider taking a shot at Seabass and Seabass with. I don't feel like counting that right now. Why is this not telling me how many they are? Oh, they are. 20 bits. Thank you, Seabass. <laughs> ACA says, welcome to the future, human sacrifice. Do you want the red or the blue pill? <laughs> uh, I'll take the red pill. Thank you very much. We've acquired CR1, Victor 2. We still have the wire. Third contact out there. We have three active pings. Sierra 3. Come on. Come on. Oh, crap. I don't want it to be. Con sonar lost contact. Okay. Sierra, it is a Sierra. Not good. Not good. Not good. Seabass <laughs> says my bot is great. <laughs> Fred Rider says between Seabass and Nyoto Exodus gets a whole quarter. Yeah, I get one set per one cent per bit. 
<laughs> uh, but thank you. I will use your quarter wisely. Con sonar lost Do chatbots dream of electric three, babies? Last bearing one eight zero. <laughs> contact faded. <laughs> Not quite. Uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> electric babies. Sea bass, you're gonna have to. I've spent 150 on 100 bits. You're welcome. <laughs> Well, thank you, Seabass. <laughs> you guys are dorks. <laughs> I love all of you, though. Uh, it makes it so much more fun gaming. All right, we're going to snapshot on the CR2 Alpha here. I don't like him just lurking over there. Actually, better idea. Better idea. I'm going to take Eisenwolf's uh, suggestion that he always makes, and we're going to shoot... A moss bearing one six one. Shoot four. Con, torpedo room firing two four. <laughs> the exchange rate is all over the place. Yeah. One euro for ten bits. That seems way off. Or one cent euro or whatever it is. That seems way off. Because. The euro is not, one euro is not worth 15 US dollars. Just not how it works. Con, torpedo room, tube four ready. Con, torpedo room, tube five ready. Point oh one for one, for 10? Um, 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 come on, Alpha, why do you never get soaked up on the moss? Um, I don't like the looks of this. Uno, dos, they are closing in pretty madly. Okay, Sierra looks like it might be taking the bait. Helm, right full rudder, make your course two, three, five. <laughs> uh, sea basses, there you go, a whole half dollar. <laughs> uh, thank you. <laughs> okay. Passing 600 feet. Dive, make your depth 500 feet. Uh, sea bass. I didn't say anything. Uh, Digital Pope did. Or no, Red Rider did. Yeah, Red Rider, not Digital Pope. <laughs> there is a part of me that wants to get 100 bits and give them one bit at a time. <laughs> well, if you can make... There's the Sierra. If you can make the cup explode, that's half the fun, right? <laughs> cup is almost to exploding. He's like a, one heavy bit and it'll go psh. Uh, ACA says, I don't know, it's just what the jingle said during his stream. I can't see the cost, don't have a credit card. Oh. No worries. Being here talking, that's payment. I'm happy. Thank you. That's support. That's all I'm asking. All right. Uh, Alpha's getting too close. Firepoint procedure, Sierra 2 Alpha. Bearing 103, range 2,100 yards. Shoot Con, one. Torpedo room, firing two, one. We're going to lose that wire. I'm okay with that. It shouldn't come back on us. Really, really, this is what we're, this is what we're gonna start, Sea Bass. <laughs> oh man! <laughs> Apparently, this is what we're starting. Uh, 
guys, let me know if that uh, sound that cups up. Is, uh, I'm gonna have to make like the minimum. <laughs> um, <laughs> is that, uh, is that alert too loud, guys? Thank you, Red, even though you're kind of being a dork about it. <laughs> oh, man. Nah, it's okay. Okay. Thank you, Eisenwolf. ACA Hawk says, I have to say you have a beautiful daughter. She reminds me of my own. Yeah. She's, uh... Yeah, that's my nephew. And my wife. What's up? Hi, buddy. <laughs> and Delithia says, Hi, crazy mass. Hi, crazy mass murderer in the background. You're a mass murderer, apparently. I've known that for I've known that for years already. And you guys are jerks. Honey, there's a torpedo. Honey. We're gonna die. Con sonar lost. A head flank. Zero three. Con sonar. Torpedo in the water. Torpedo in the water. Bearing one zero nine. To Lithia? I don't know. All right, and noisemaker. <laughs> Red Rider, thank you for the twenty-five bits. That didn't work. Ah, knuckle form. There's the noisemaker I was looking for. I can't believe he's homed in on me and not the wreck. All right, which way is he gonna turn? Which way, okay. So helm right full rudder, come back over the wreck. Down ballast. I'm not taking two. Baby difficulty mode is bad enough. I don't need double baby difficulty mode. Alright. <laughs> Left full rudder. Come right full rudder. God, knuckle formed. There we go. Knuckle formed. Dodge the torpedo. Should go into countermeasure avoidance. Should go into counter. Okay, he's turning back to the right. Helm right full rudder. <laughs> Just needed to get rid of some. See best why why did it all at once? Cup is death full. Well thank you. <laughs> thank you guys for the support. It means a lot, even if it's you know, no matter how big or how small, I appreciate it greatly. Torpedo closing. Left full rudder. Launch Noisemaker. Come on, come on. Soak up on the wreck. It's right there. Oh, shoot. All up on the planes, all up ballast. Bring us over the torpedo. Passing 500 feet. This is going to be close. Passing 400 feet. Another torpedo in the water. Passing 300 feet. Damn you, Sierra. Passing 200 feet. Level out the boat. Stay left full rudder. Make for last known location of Sierra 3. That torpedo looks like it's homing on the wreck. Another torpedo po probable, unless that one exploded. Oh, thank God. That one exploded. All right, hopefully this will soak back up on the wreck. Launch transient. One third. Helm up. Dead ahead. So past 20 knots. Come on, come on, come on. Back emergency. Helm, I. 
snapshot, down active bearing. All head flank, all head flank. I don't need to say all, but I did anyways. God, the Sierra's kind of torpedo happy. Fire control, enabled torpedo. Left full rudder, down bubble. Down full bubble. Launch noisemaker. Passing 200 feet. Con, sonar, torpedo in the water. Torpedo in the water. Bearing. One, five, seven. Passing 300 feet. Passing 400 feet. Level up. Con, oh. Knuckle formed. Stay right full rudder. Noisemaker, right full rudder, all up ballast, all up on the planes. Get us over these torpedoes, please. Passing four hundred. I did feet. pass over the wreck. Sonar. We are cavitating. Passing bring, three hundred. Bring the butt feet. up. Oh my god! All these guys. Con knuckle formed. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! Pull up! Pull up! That's too close. Passing 200 feet. All right, level up ballast. Rudder amidships. Sierra's being chased pretty hard. Yeah, I know. I know ACA, the small bits add up pretty quickly, and that's why I greatly appreciate anybody who even bid donates one bit. So thank you guys very much again. <laughs> Omega Twitch bot keeps coming alive! Alright, that one's heading toward the wreck. Oh no, it's circling. Now, I did update to 1.06 Bravo the newest patch uh, that you can opt in for the beta, which they did say they made wrecks less likely to pick up active torpedoes. So that would explain why not all of them soaked up on the wreck. Maybe you should try the Russian surface trick. <laughs> nope, we're far enough away. I think we're safe. We got all three enemy subs, only weapons nearby keeping us from leaving. Going to time compression, wait for those torpedoes to go boom. Delithia says, full crazy Ivan, no need right now. Can you jump a sea wolf? Blue the skid says, did the enemy sub just torp itself? Nope. All three subs are dead. I sank all three subs with my torpedoes. All right, we're going head flank. This one will be for Red Rider. Passing nice evading. Feet. Thank you. Uh, there were a couple of really close calls there. Passing 300 feet. Hop over the torps by shooting yourself out of the water. Passing yeah. 400 feet. We're going to try something similar right Passing now. Passing 500 feet. All right, Red Rider, you paying attention? You better be paying attention. Passing 600 feet. All right, all rise on the planes, all rise ballast. Let's see what the Sea Wolf can do. Passing 600 feet. Passing 500 feet. 35 knots. Passing 400 feet. Con sonar, we are ca passing 300 feet. Passing 200 feet. Passing 100 feet. Eh, it was less impressive than I thought. Toway says, I saw they got to go, but the stream has been awesome. See you next time. Thanks for passing tuning in, Toway. We'll see you next time. Alpha Sierra and Victor 2. That was a pretty dangerous hunter-killer group. That Sierra was very torpedo-happy. 
<laughs> I just went flop like a flat whale. Now the alpha literally jumps out of the water. That sucker is fast. Germany conquered. Dang. Anticlimactic, yeah, I tried. Hey, Red Rider, I tried for you. You know, I tried for you. For you. Okay, what the hell is our mission? Is it still that hunter wolf pack? Yeah, it's the wolf pack still. Red Rider says, All right, I have an interview in the morning and need my beauty rest. <laughs> you need a little bit more than beauty rest. You need a whole beauty body swap. By the way, what's the tonnage at right now, ACA Hawk wants to know? Let's go find out. We'll reload at port and it'll tell us our tonnage. I think. I think you have to go back to port. Oh, cool. Did I get it? I don't think I got it. I'd never seen that image before. That's really cool. It's really cool. Nice try out, Rexus. <laughs> Ooh, Etsy replenishment tankers. I really want to do it. What's our stores at? I really want to do this one. Six harpoons, two moss, and 13 ad caps. All right, they're sailing from Archangel for a rendezvous in the Greenland Sea. All right, we're going to do this mission, then we'll check on the tonnage. Oh yeah, you can check tonnage anytime. Where? Am I missing it somewhere? Hit escape, then summary. Ah, oh, dang it. Okay, good to know, good to know. We're gonna close the 10,000 yards. I think this is our group. Hi, Anya. <laughs> Hi, baby girl. Hi, Vivi. <laughs> uh, just, you already thanked Ashley. You thanked the one that's important. <laughs> All right, close to. No, I can reheat it later. Thank you, babe. Yeah, that's fine. <gasps> Am I going into baby difficulty? Hi, baby. All right, now here's where my uh, baby difficulty mode would activate baby difficulty. Yes. Why are you so squirmy? Um, what was I looking for here? I was looking for something here. Oh God, right into the ribs, really? And now you're bouncing on them. Ow, God. Okay, we're good. Rig ship for ultra quiet. Rig ship for ultra quiet. That's what I just said. Thank you, though. <laughs> Hi, monkeys. Princess Anna. Hi, baby. <laughs> Hi, babies. Good luck, fair seas and clean diapers. Yeah, pretty much. Blue the Skid asks, what is your setup you stream on? Ah. Uh, I have kind of a upper mid-range computer with only one screen and a webcam above the screen, obviously, using my Corsair Vortex headset, or I think it's a Vortex headset, and I use an iPad to keep an eye on Twitch chat right in front of me. Oh! Oh! Well, I'm glad you're having a grand old time. <laughs> Why are you chewing on my shoulder? Oh, man. We have a contact. That's all that matters right now. Uh -huh. And yes, she's bouncing on my ribs still. Ow. Oh. Oh. <laughs> God. All right. We're going to.
gonna classify Sierra One as an Ugra. Sonar. Sierra One. Ma ma yeah ma ma ma. <laughs> ma ma ma. Ow. Oh. Ah. Oh God. Really? Really? Ow. God, it's her big toes are like knives. Ugh. Just put her on your stomach so she pushes on your midriff. I used to do the same. I try that, but then she moglies her way up my ribs. <laughs> Good call, Blue, this kid. Good call, Blue. Oh. Sonar, new contact bearing. One, two, one. Designated Sierra, two. And she's, she's like a furnace. My God. My wife turns into a furnace as well whenever she goes to sleep. God. Sierra two is classified. Oh, as okay. Do you wanna do you wanna stand on my leg? Oh God. <laughs> and with the cannibalism again. Ow. Hi baby. I'm like a jungle gym, guys. Ow. I'm really happy I'm not being shot at right now. <laughs> God. Oh. She just tried to toe rip my nipple off. Ouch. Baby girl. It's okay. <laughs> Come uh. It's the time of night when daddy turns into chopped liver. Oh. I kid you not, I have bruises on my ribs after streaming because she climbs on me so much. <laughs> oh, I love it. You get all the punishment and then they want mom. <laughs> or grandma in this case. Uh, Blue says, really, my mother's always an ice cube. It could be 100 out and she's like, I'm cold. Wow. Uh, nope, my wife and I both start getting warm at room temperature. <laughs> We keep our AC running quite a bit. All right, let's come to periscope depth. Now that I'm done being attacked by the Kraken, this is why play pens were invented. She would scream. She, especially when there's people over, she has to be the center of attention, which is not like her mother. Her mother isn't like that. Helm left full rudder, come to zero nine zero. Passing 100 feet. Con sonar new contact There's one, the third four, contact. Nine, designated Sierra three. And there's the dog, or as Red would say, not dog. Sierra so three, really another cannon. Con sonar Sierra. Three another cannon. Is classified as escort. Up scope, up BSM. Why does Sierra two look like he's closing in really fast? Low light, switch to Sierra 2, bearing 134. Yeah, he's awfully close. He is awfully close. Eight thousand eight hundred yards. That's pretty close. There's the Ugra. And Master 3 bearing 153. There you are. Sonar be on the lookout for possible submerged contacts. The Don and the Ugra double as submarine tenders. Be glad I haven't been able to see my daughter in three weeks. Makes me want to burn down my own house. Oh, No matter how difficult you may be. Yeah. Yeah, that would be rough. You have my deepest sympathies. Firepoint Procedure Master 2 Cannon, Tube 1, bearing 154, range 6,000 yards. 
Shoot one. Torpedo room. Firing two one. Firepoint procedure. Master three cannon. Bearing one six three. Range thirteen thousand three hundred yards. Con. Torpedo room. Firing two five. And firepoint procedure master one Ugra bearing one three nine range thirteen thousand four hundred yards. Con torpedo room firing tube two. <sighs> Man, she like rips my elbow out of its socket. See the big baby. We're really disappointed that this is the group. I really, 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 really want a capital ship tonight. Fire control enable torpedo one. Should acquire there we are. Cannons are dangerous at close range. They have RBU six thousands. There's not the dock again. <laughs> Lower the ESM map. Con sonar, new contact bearing. And there's our submerged contact, gentlemen. Possible Akula? Looks like an Akula. Yikes. I don't know why we didn't hear him right off the bat. Kula bearing 185. Con sonar lost contact. Oh, Master hi. Two. You're Last closer than you one, look like, too. Five, four. Contact breaking up. We got Master 2. Alright, let's get a torpedo out on the bearing of Sierra 4. Firepoint procedure. Sierra 4, bearing 188, range 5,600 yards. Shoot Con, 6. Torpedo room, firing tube 6. Fire control, enable the torpedo. We're going to have it run enabled the whole way on passive. Fire control, turn torpedo right 20 degrees. Torpedo 5 looks to be a good enable point. Torpedo 2 should be good as well. We know that Ugra's down here, actually. <laughs> ACA Hawk says, I'm going to put you on my second screen and lurk till I fall asleep. I'll talk to you more tomorrow. Thanks for tuning in, ACA Hawk. Glad to have you here. Glad you were able to make my first stream as a Twitch affiliate. Thanks again. And Chaos Fear says, I think Killerfish Games needs to ramp up the aggro on the AI. That Akula, it's an Akula 1, not an Akula 2. That Akula should be all over here. You would think. Although, I can't tell now, because I think I was always kind of partially in his baffles. Con, sonar, lost contact. Would Master explain why one, he never really bearing, honed one, in on four, me. Three, contact breaking up. Oh, he's about to have a bad day. I'd classify that as a bad day. Well, like they keep saying, AI is what they're trying to work on. I believe I remember seeing Julhelm, one of their artist guys, say they didn't have a tool to check the AI outside of the game for the longest time. Tornado Dash, welcome to the stream. Good to see you. Hope you're having a good night. Yeah, so it would make sense if they didn't have a tool to check the AI outside of the game because 
And I believe you said they do now, so they're working on improvements. Do we still have the wire? I'm shocked we still have that wire. Con sonar regained contact on. Fire control, steer torpedo on the bearing, Sierra 4. Absolutely shocked we still have that. Yep, that's definitely an Akula. They use the Victor 3 hull. Oh, Tornado Dash is NXT! Nice! Did not know that. Good to see ya. I'm just gonna call you Dash from now on. Like Dash Rendar. I'm glad you can make it over to Twitch. I should have asked Red Rider too if uh, they saw my announcement video over on YouTube saying I'm only going to be on Twitch. How about you, Dash? You see the, hey, I'm only going to be on Twitch video. Why is the clip showing on me? This, why is this clip showing on me? What? What? What clip? I'm confused. Torpedo closing on Akula. Shouldn't be able to outrun. He's only going 35 knots. We should, we still have the wire. We should have a much better track on him than this. Sorry guys for the momentary pause. All tabbed out real quick. While we're sitting here, might as well reload the tubes. Nope, torpedo's closing, it's just closing slowly. Actually not as slowly as one would have thought. I think the speed on these things is 50 knots, isn't it? On the Mark 48 ad caps? 50 or 55 knots, I believe. I'll have to double check that. Yeah, he's just trying to run. Sad showing from the AI here, but we'll take the kill. Sierra four. We will Last definitely bearing, take two, the kill. One, zero. Contact breaking up. Alright. Anything else nearby? Negative. Actually I'm gonna use this as a screen grab. Try to get some pretties for my thumbnails. Alrighty, leave combat. We sunk all four targets. And should have made the Admiral pretty happy. Superb effort. Heck yeah. NATO naval push. Boom, baby. Uh, Alright, we're not going to engage a diesel electric. Continue on course. Alright, summary. Ah, ha, 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 ha. See, this is why we keep Chaos Sphere around. He tells me these things. We are at 587,000 tons. Not bad. Not bad. Started out the night with 444,000, I believe. Not bad. Alright, let's see what trouble we can get into up here. I'd really like to find a capital ship somewhere. I would, I would. Oh my god, oh my god. Where did he go? Oh man. Makes me very 
very sad. And, and then we find something. Oi. Right, we're only going to close the 20,000 yards because I have a feeling it's going to be shallow and we are going at a full bell. Reload all the stuffs. And immediately. Big shift for ultra quiet. There we go. How is it this deep? Con sonar regained contact on. Really? Zero, one bearing three Holy zero crap. seven. Why does that look like it could be an Udaloy? Probably because it's an Udaloy. Con sonar new contact bearing. On sonar, Sierra Two is classified. That as was escort. really loud. Right for rudder. You now. Noctwool, thank you for the follow. I believe you were over on YouTube already. I know I've seen you somewhere. But thank you for the follow. Welcome to my Twitch stream. Maybe it was on Twitch and you just hadn't followed yet. Either way, thank you for the follow. Hope you're having a good night. Oh, yeah, duh. <laughs> Sorry, knocked. I'm. I've been baby difficulted out tonight. My ribs are about all to crack, so my pain. Apologizes. <laughs> but seriously, my daughter tried to crack all my ribs tonight. It wasn't it was not not good. Alright, which way do we want to be looking here? Uh, helm, make your co oh shh things about to get interesting. Time to put a torpedo out towards the Udaloy. Five point procedure, CR1 Udaloy, bearing 310, range 7,700 yards. Shoot two. On. Torpedo room, firing tube two. And get us below the layer. Dive, make your depth. Ooh, 110 feet. All right, we don't want to go all down on the planes then. Let's just use ballast. Momentary pause. Sorry, guys. Why are you being evil? <laughs> there we go. That's better. That's better. That's what I wanted to see. Okay, back to it. And that's Passing why I wanted feet. to dive. All ahead, flank. Ahead, flank. Helm, eye. All down ballast. All down planes. Left full rudder. Con sonar lost contact. Sierra. Yeah, Passing con I know. Sonar. Torpedo in the water. Torpedo in the water. Bearing one eight zero. See, bass. I'm Passing back again. Okay, feet. welcome back again. We like it when you come back again. Passing 400 feet. Passing right, how deep is this torpedo going to go? Helm right full rudder. Ah, knuckle form. Level out the boat. Passing 700 feet. No idea how successful that's going to be. Passing 800 feet. down ballast. Try to stay just below his detection radius. Second torpedo in the water. Where the hell is it? Passing 900 feet. There it is. Oh, he's searching really hard. Alright, 
this torpedo might pick us back up right now. That's okay. No idea on our torpedo. Yep, he's coming back down. Damn it. All right. Con, sonar, lost contact. Sierra, We're one, just going to run fast and run three, deep for a zero, little bit here. Two, contact breaking up. Did we get the Udaloi? <gasps> oh, thank God, we got the Udaloi. Snapshot was good. Timing. Yeah. All right, we're going to run this torpedo out a little bit. We are at a head flank. We're maxed out on speed. Passing 1,000 feet. Just because my OCD kicked in, I'm like, I can't be at 998 feet. It needs to be a thousand. <laughs> All right, come on, torpedo. You should be running out of juice. God, how freaking deep is it here? Can't believe it's this deep, this close to Archangel. I'm like right nearby Gramica and Archangel. I can't believe it's this deep. Yeah, buddy. Helm ahead one-third. Ahead one-third. Helm I. Passing 1,000 feet. Make your depth five zero feet. Come to periscope depth. Passing 900 feet. That's what you get for shooting that green shit at me. Red shit. Passing 800 <laughs> feet. Alrighty. I'm coming left to course north. Passing 700 Let's feet. Reacquire that cash in. At least I think it was a cash in. Yep. I hear you, Passing Hilo. 600 feet. Alright, level out the boat. That is awfully close. Recon, God damn it. Torpedo in the water. Torpedo in the water. All head Bear. flank. Left full rudder. All down on the planes. All down ballast. All down on the planes. All down ballast. Come right full rudder. Passing 600 feet. Passing 700 feet. Passing 800 feet. Passing 900 feet. Helm left Passing full rudder. Level feet. out the boat. Con, knuckle formed. Passing 1100 feet. Second torpedo in the water. Come left course north. Passing 1,200 feet. Kilo has fired both of its torpedoes. Con, sonar. Yep, torpedo I was in worried the water. that torpedo, torpedo was going to be acquired. Bearing. Two, three, zero. Which one acquired? That one acquired? That I didn't expect. That one I did not expect. Didn't expect it to be that one. I figured that one would. I thought the other one was further away. The other one sure as hell looked like it was further away. On the bright side, the Cashin does not have SSN-14s, so we won't see any torpedoes dropping in from that ship. However, you, sir, are an asshole. Alright, we're at past 1,200 feet. This torpedo is using up a lot of energy to move.
Hassan, torpedo room 2-2 two, two ready. Good job. Brace yourselves for evasive maneuvers. Launch noisemaker. Left full rudder, all up on the planes, all up ballast. Passing 1,200 feet. Passing 1,100 feet. Switch to right full runner. Passing 1,000 feet. Cons, knuckle form. Passing 900 feet. Passing 800 feet. That one's gone. Passing 700 feet. Passing 600 Come feet. Helm bring us above the layer. Passing five. Ahead standard. Ahead standard. Helm, aye. Passing 300 feet. Level out the boat. Passing 200 feet. Ahead one third. Ahead one third. Helm, aye. Left full rudder. Set your course north. Yeah. He sent it deep. He guessed Passing my tactic. Passing 100 feet. Every once in a while, the AI surprises you with its intelligence. Doesn't happen very often, but it happens. Con sonar regain there we contact go. on Sierra two bearing zero five six. <laughs> All righty. And we're going to sink the Cashin with a harpoon. Cashin does not have any Sea Whiz. Five point procedure Sierra 2 Cashin. Bearing 5 6, range 8 600 yards. Shoot Con, 3. Torpedo room, firing tube 3. And we know the Hilo launched both of its torpedoes. So the Hilo isn't much of a threat now. This guy's way out there. Con, torpedo room, tube three ready. The hell was that? That's not a cash in. God damn it. All head flank. All down on the Ahead planes. Flank. Helm, aye. Damn it. Passing 100 feet. Con sonar lost contact. I hit him. Two. That's Last good. Passing 200 feet. Passing 300 feet. Damn it. Passing 400 feet. Passing 500 feet. Passing 600 feet. Passing 700 feet. Passing 1,200 feet. Passing 1,300 feet. Where the hell did those missiles go? Attaboy. Attaboy. Ahead, one-third. Helm, aye. Con sonar regained contact. Passing 1,200 feet. Passing 1,100 feet. Passing 900 feet. Passing 800 feet. Passing 700 feet. Passing 600 feet. Passing 500 feet. Passing 400 feet. Passing 300 feet. Passing 200 feet. You think, Seabass? You think there's a bug in the bot? 
<laughs> All right, we're gonna shoot one more harpoon at him. Con, torpedo room, firing tube three. Did he already put out? Looks like he already put out the damage. Con, torpedo room, tube three, ready. Possible sea whiz. Set it to enable like ten yards past him. Con, torpedo room, firing tube three. Ship is throwing not sunk. Yeah, thanks. Mm -hmm. I figured that. <laughs> Ship's throwing not sunk. <laughs> you freaking jerk. <laughs> Con, torpedo room, tube three ready. More incoming torpedoes, all ahead flank. Ahead flank, helm, high. Down on the planes, down full bubble. Down sonar, lost contact. That's better. Passing 200 feet. Passing 300 feet. Passing 700 feet. Passing 1200 feet. Uh, yeah. Alright, now we run and get the heck out of combat. <laughs> Aircraft's still nearby. 1,300 feet down, what do you mean aircraft's still nearby? There we go. Get out of combat. Udalina Krivak. Not bad. Considering they have shot at us right off the bat. Alright. We're going to go ahead and save there and call the stream for the night. Thank you everybody for tuning in. Thank you everybody who followed, subscribed. Cheered bits. I'm going to figure out how to say that better because that sounded horrible. But thank you guys for tuning in. I really appreciate it, and I hope to see you guys either on a stream this weekend, possibly, possibly not, or Monday for the scheduled stream at 6 p.m. Hope you all have a wonderful night. Until next time, happy hunting, and I'll stick around and chat for a minute or two and say hi. Take care. See you next time.